garage experimenting tonight uh, I wasn't planning to paint tonight but it started raining and I love rain so much I decided you know what I'm gonna go outside and I'm gonna use up all this leftover paint I have I have I'm going to do a, a pour it's gonna be a flip cup with one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen colors so that are uh, left over from the last couple of weeks of pouring they've been in there just uh, waiting for my cats to knock them over so thought all right well i'll do this so anyway that's what i'm going to do i've thinned them out just a hair because they've they have gotten a little bit uh thick sitting there And I'm going a little sparingly on the silicone because I don't know if any of them have silicone in there already. So, I don't remember. Alright. But I hope it turns out pretty. We shall see. some pretty colors. And yeah, I kind of slammed it down there. Um, I really slammed it down. Ooh, that's pretty. Combo right there. What's going on there? That's gold green, pink. Oh, well, I have to remember that. That's pretty combo. Take this one over here. All right, I'm going to do the Julie Cuts pull. I'll let it. That is some pretty reactions here. that and then I will pull this one to turn Mr. Guy around and we'll do this one. That's some pretty stuff. Those Liquitex colors are just amazing. They're truly, truly amazing. I wish that I could afford to use them all the time. The vibrancy is just 
what's the word I'm looking for? Amazing. They're freaking amazing. All right. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. I wonder what the neighbors think. I'm out here kind of talking to myself. But I, I we know I'm talking to y'all. But, but to anyone else... <laughs> So I've been wanting to try heat gun anyway, I do a little bit more with the heat gun just after watching and studying what Julie Cuts does and uh, her philosophy on kind of minimal, minimalist torching. I think that the heat gun, it gives a wider, I just think it may achieve better results. So I'm going to do that for a second from real high up. Whoa, hey. Okay, let's see what we can do with some tilting. I want some of that to go away. I want So I think that um, these paints sat a long time and I think that it got some uh, separation going on of the pigments. You can kind of see it down here. It's got graininess. Um, Michelle Stringer has a video out that explains what causes that and how to avoid it, how to, some things you can add to your paints to help, um, so I just poured that off, to help minimize that graininess. And um, she talks about glycerin and she talks about alcohol, but I just need to, uh, go and study that video a little more so I'm very happy with this little thing for a leftover paint nice use of it it's a it's pretty it's a pretty little flip cup so yeah got to be outside in the rain and play with some colors that I don't usually put together. So, the, these cups, the inside of these cups are just, I don't know if you can, or the outside, I mean, that's a, that's a work of art, just looking at the, what that cup looks like from the outside. Dang. It's like there's some more paint in there. I'm tempted to like, pour it onto there. Actually, I think I'm going to. Just like that. Some other colors in there. There are.
Well, those colors are beautiful. Let's see if that wants to make any cells at all. Hello. It does. Cute. Okay, cute little area of stripy cells. I'm not going to, I know that that would give me cells if I torch there, but I'm not going to because I have self-restraint. So, all right. I think this is interesting here, this um, really dark. I'll bring you down close so you can see it. It's an interesting little painting. Uh, I hope it stays like that. I like it. So, if you can see here where there's that graininess. And that is not, that's not mica or metallic. That's just, maybe it is actually. I did use that. You know what? That's what that is. That is that white, pearl white. Because huh. that's, because I used that in a different painting and that's what it looked like. This right here is pretty gorgeous. That dark blue and uh, orange going on there. I mean, they kind of look like three different paintings a little bit. The three different cups, you can definitely tell they're, but uh, I don't care. I think it's neat. <laughs> it's pretty. Just those colors are so vibrant. Yeah, that is pearl on the surface here. Uh, so I don't necessarily like that about that paint. My uh, iridescent paints don't do that. I guess maybe that's just a thing with the pearl paints. All right, so anyway, well, hope you enjoyed this little spontaneous use up the leftover paint flip cup, and um, I sure appreciate y'all joining me. I am not sure when I'm going to publish this, but it'll be this week, and I know that I'm going to hit 10,000 subscribers this week, and uh, so that's exciting. It's, I never thought I'd hit 10,000 subscribers, so I'm going to do a big old giveaway. I'm going to uh, give details on that in one of my next videos. So, just going to, I'm still working through what I'm going to give away. Because it's not just going to be paintings, it's going to be glitter and bath stuff and just awesome things. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. Share it with somebody. That'd be awesome. The more you share it, the the better, the more people will see it. And then that's also one of the things that YouTube uses to rank it when people search. So the more shares the video has. So if you shared it with somebody, shared it on Pinterest, shared it on your Facebook, that's awesome. I sure appreciate all y'all so much. You keep me inspired and motivated. It's it's fun to paint with y'all, so I'm gonna start doing some live videos before too long if I can talk my husband into helping me out uh, field. You know, you're gonna need somebody there with you to because people ask questions and stuff like that. So if I could talk him into it, that that will definitely be a something that's happening. I don't like those caterpillars, but that's okay. All right. See y'all on the next video. Happy pouring.